right, guys. This is a guy with a saxophone in Punta Gorda, Florida, thinking that he can kick Andy off the corner that he's on all the time. You know, Andy likes to turn tricks, makes extra money. You know, he's not just a First Amendment advocate and a protester holding a sign against Joe Biden. He is also a, uh, well, let me put it to you this way. Listen to the lyrics of the Kinks song Lola. L-O-L-A, Lola. That's the, uh, the song you want to look up. So that's Andy's deal. So on the weekends, he's got to make that extra money. So anyway, this guy had a saxophone. He was on the sidewalk, and he's freaking out on Andy because Andy has his free speech and his sign next to where this guy is trying to collect money for a saxophone playing as if they're somehow interrelated. He's not playing saxophone for Joe Biden or against Joe Biden. He's just one of a, you know street performers. Andy's a street performer, too. Um, you know, I don't know what it is that he performs other than acts of stupidity on a daily basis. Uh, but you'd have to ask his wife about that. So anyway, um, enjoy this video. It's hilarious. And qualified immunity, you can end the war on Trump and the January Sixers. You're really going to do that right there, well, right next to where I'm playing? Uh, yeah, I'm usually here first. But I, but I was. Yeah. Right, no, I know, but I'm here over here. Yeah, but today I'm already set up and playing. Right, I know. I'm, I'm so set. Rude. I, it is very so rude. rude it is rude I've been going here for years dude I was here first thank you dude I, I'm trying to save the country man and qualified immunity so you can save Trump and the uh, and the January sixers right right next to me it's one thing if you're gonna I've been coming here for years man I'm playing music, man. You guys want to That's, hear some music or you want to hear this guy? All hear right. Whatever do you, he's saying. Yeah, do you want to save the country or hear some music? I'd rather save the country. so rude. I can't believe someone. Dude, you're being rude that. right now, man. I would never do that to somebody. Dude, you did it last time I was here, so knock it off. I, I was. Dude, last time I was here, you did it to me, so. Now you're raising your voice. Stop. Stop. I can't believe you. Dude, I can't believe you either. And qualified immunity and stop the war on Trump just and the January your Sixers. Actions, you just turned me away. I know, right? Your yes. And qualified immunity, you can stop the war on Trump and the January And qualified immunity and the war on Trump and the January Sixers. What is this? So if we end qualified immunity, we can we can stop uh, what they're doing to Trump and the January Sixers because then we can sue them. Right now, they have qualified immunity. They're like gods. You can't do anything. It's it's sad. Former, man, and, and by the way, we never had this before. I Yes. Dude, I was here last time and you killed mine. All right? Do you understand? Mine. It's, 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 my whole life it's on how to do this. video, this dude. I do. Dude, I so see that, that. See? Look. I was here last time and you did it to me. All right? Just stop, dude. There's a performance going on and you're doing this right now. You time. did that to me last time. Knock it it's, off. It's a performance. It's something totally the, different. Dude, you. Wow. So I was here last time, so you can do it because uh, you hate America, free last speech. Last time, I don't even know what you're doing. Dude, talking. it's on video. You did. I can't believe that uh, someone would do that. Why and qualify. Just stop. I would never do exactly. That. He did it to me last time I was here. It's crap, man. It's crap. And qualified immunity and stop the war on Trump and the January Sixers. Thank you. And qualified immunity and free speech. We both have the right to do this. But we have courtesy for you. Know, Dude, for you did it right? to me. Stop. You're harassing me now. I'm not All right? harassing Dude, One of I was here last time, and you freaking blew me out last time. Jesus Christ. It's on video. You got an email. I'll send it to you. All right? No, I'm not giving you money. All right. Anything. Thank you. All right. It's just it's just a courtesy thing. Dude, Dude you did it to there, me. Do you, you, hear, what, do you hear what you're saying, man? I don't, you I don't did know it to me about. last time I, I was about, here. I was, I was Dude, I was here last here time, you, and you freaking speak. went over there and ruined it's my code. Dude, it, it is a matter of courtesy. Dude, it is a matter of courtesy. And you, and you, and you screwed me last Oh my God, so, stop. Wow. So, wow. Wow. Okay. And qualified immunity can stop the Warren Trump and the A6ers. And qualified immunity can end the Warren Trump and the January Sixers. God damn it, dude. You fucking did it me. You you did way too many drugs. And qualified immunity can end the war on January 6th and uh, Trump. Are All right, guys. This is a guy with a saxophone in Punta Gorda, Florida, thinking that he can kick Andy off the corner that he's on all the time. You know, Andy likes to turn tricks, makes extra money. You know, he's not just a First Amendment advocate and a protester holding a sign 
against Joe Biden. He is also a, uh, well, let me put it to you this way. Listen to the lyrics of the Kinks song Lola. L-O-L-A, Lola. That's the, uh, the song you want to look up. So that's Andy's deal. So on the weekends, he's got to make that extra money. So anyway, this guy had a saxophone. He was on the sidewalk, and he's freaking out on Andy because Andy has his free speech and his sign next to where this guy is trying to collect money for a saxophone playing as if they're somehow interrelated. He's not playing saxophone for Joe Biden or against Joe Biden. He's just one of a, you know street performers. Andy's a street performer, too. Um, you know, I don't know what it is that he performs other than acts of stupidity on a daily basis. Uh, but you'd have to ask his wife about that. So anyway, um, enjoy this video. It's hilarious.